this year's game, First Rescue. <laughs> So we've talked about two different robots that does some things very well. The two competing strategies. We have a robot that scores in a low goal and focuses only on the low goal. So it's going to lift itself up, it's going to score in the high goal, do the all clear, and then come all the way up. That's the strategy for the low goal score. The other strategy is our medium score in ramp climber. That robot is going to be mainly scoring in the medium goal, where it runs up and down the ramp, scoring in the medium goal. At the end of the match, it's going to go to the end game, to where it goes up the ramp, scores in the medium goal, gets the zip lines along the way, climbs on the way, rest of the way uh, to the cliff bar, hits the all clear, then moves the way all the way up, but it completely ignores the high, high goal. So we just tried to figure out a couple of things when doing this. How many trips can we make to and from the medium goal? How many trips do we think we can make to and from the low goal? And we worked out the equation. So basically, if you go to the low goal once and do a full dump, you get 25 points. So that we're going to call that one trip is 25x. Same thing over here on the medium score. If one trip up to the medium score and you dump them all in, uh, assuming you get all five, you get 50 points. So that's going to be 50x. The main difference between these two robots: this robot gets 60 points for the zip lines. This robot gets 75 points because on its last dump, it's going to dump 75 points into the high goal. So that brings us to the equation, 25x plus 75 equals 50x plus 60. Basically what we we're trying to figure out is, if we were to build a medium sized robot, how many trips do we think we can go to the medium goal before having to climb the rest of the way up and get it? And we think the answer is maybe three trips. So that gives us 150 points if we can go to the medium goal. So if you take the 150 plus 60, that gets us to 210 points with this design of robot. How many times do we have to go now to the low goal in the other robot to get the same 210 points? Doing a little bit of math, we come down to five and two-fifths trips to the, uh, to the low goal to get the same number of points. Our concern with this is that we don't think if you go to the high, if you go to the low goal that many times, it's going to be full. So the last dump, all your balls or debris are going to scatter across the field and you're not going to get any more points for doing so. 